they are all, um, actually they're all one and the same. Uh, because you cannot have development that is sustainable in the long term if you are constantly being threatened by natural disasters that could wipe out two to three percent of your GDP as we've already seen last year. There's no way that you can relieve poverty if you have natural disasters that wipe out entire cities, entire provinces that dis dislocate 20 million people like we have in Pakistan. There's just no way that you can pursue development that actually is a development that sticks unless you address the threat of climate change and begin to mitigate that. Because there is no threat to sustainable development that is greater than climate change. It could, in fact, if we don't do our job in Paris, climate change could very easily wipe out all the gains that we've made on all of the MDGs over the past 15 years. And that is something that we cannot afford as humanity to have. And we certainly cannot endanger the progress that we could potentially have on health, on food security, on energy security, on migration, because we haven't been able to address climate change. So, and disaster relief is the same. So all three processes are actually about the same challenge, and they're all moving in the direction of the type of society that we actually need.